Hello, my name is Dr. Hans, and I'm Minister of the Last Chance Rescue Missions. I'm uh, Sib Bader, the Lords of the New Church. Okay, Sib, uh, I was informed that you are the head, the leader, the founder, president. Uh, what classification are you? Uh, what do you title yourself as the Lords of the New Church? I'm the singer. You're the singer? It's, it's not a religious group? Uh, no, it's more of a movement. It's a movement, is it a secular movement? With no, religious undertones? In a sense, in rock and roll, it's a bell movement. It's getting rid of uh, all the impurity of uh, control, especially corporate control and governmental control or social control, in, uh, especially in rock society today. We will be showing you more of the debate later on in the show. You can write the original. We'll pick up on the table of the singers. Look at, uh, do you know what the, the earring and the ear symbolizes? You Scripturally? Homosexuality? No. Scripturally? No. What's that? It symbolizes uh, that it uh, is telling people that I'm a bastard. Yeah. That's right. Because the children of Ishmael, Aren't we all? Abraham's bastard children, Ishmael, uh, wild asses the bible describes him as wild ass in the desert of arabia he was the first one to pick up wearing an earring in one ear as the sign that he was a bastard and totally antagonistic against god and his way he was going to do it his way and he ended up no way yes there is and it's up to you yeah. to uh, you see it wasn't the thing i'm getting from this is that you're very close to salvation you're very close. You're, you're rubbing against the wall of it. And uh, it wouldn't take much for you to climb over the wall and enter into the blessings of God and receive the baptism of the Holy Ghost, speaking in tongues. And Jesus said, right away, clear your mind up, and you'll be so verbal and so articulate and expressing what you see that not only will you be able to do it with force, but you'll see lives change for good because of it. You're right next door. I don't know what's holding you back. My manager. Your manager, huh? Yeah, sure. It's your choice, though, right? Right. Right. Everybody's their own lord, right? Well, their own master of their own destiny. Right? If you say no to Jesus, you've lost it. Right? Well, I'd like to thank you both. You both did a wonderful job. And Stiv yeah. and Dr. Hand, I'd like to have you shake hands now. Shake the hands with Dr. Hand. Shake right. hands with the devil. <laughs> you said it. I didn't want to call you that. Remember that.